X Factor star Danny Tetley has had his prison sentence slashed, after he was found guilty of child sex offenses and sentenced to nine years in jail. The 40-year-old, who admitted seven charges of causing sexual exploitation of boys aged between 14 and 16, as well as two counts relating to the distribution of indecent images, was handed an extended sentence of 17 years nine of which he would serve behind bars however that sentence has now been cut down to 14 years. However, he has since won a bid to get his punishment cut, with Mail Online revealing he will be closely monitored on license after being released from prison for five years, as opposed to the original seven years. During an appeal at the High Court, presided over by Lady Justice Simler, it was determined the sentence was too long for the crimes. In a statement, the Criminal Appeal Office confirmed, the full court allowed the appeal and the sentence is now an extended sentence of 14 years, comprising a custodial term of 9 years and an extended period of license of 5 years. It added that the extended periods of licenses are put in place to protect the public from serious harm. In December, the singer appeared at Bradford Crown Court, after he was accused of sending messages between October 2018 and August 2019. The X Factor ran from September to December 2018, with Tetley, who made it to sixth place, being eliminated in November. His barrister Andrew Dallas had asked for the sentencing to be adjourned so the defense had time to consider well over 10,000 text messages and WhatsApp messages served. Judge Jonathan Durham Hall QC said at the time of sentencing, this has been most distressing for the victims. The press are here in force for the extent of gravity of the case, the number of child victims. Your celebrity is now gone, tarnished and destroyed. The judge said that Tetley exploited the status that the X Factor gave him, saying, you abused that status to satisfy your perverted sexual needs, and assessed Tetley as a highly predatory and manipulative individual. Judge Durham Hall said that grooming was at the heart of the case, noting the young age of the boys 14, 15 and 16 and said, what you demanded and showed were blatant and the disgusting level to which you sank, Mr. Tetley, was quite unbelievable. Andrew Dallas, defending, told the court, he was effectively alone in a very public world, emotionally vulnerable and being given money for his singing, all of which is gone. By the time he was locked up, he was penniless. It was easy come, easy go, as the saying goes. He added that Tetley's motivation was solely to gain images and that he had no interest in going any further. The NSPCC said in a statement at the time, Tetley's use of his TV appearances and promises of money in the thousands of messages he sent these boys, are an example of the depraved lengths that predators will go to in their pursuit of victims. Before pleading guilty in December, Tetley had denied the allegations. The singer, who worked in Benidorm as a performer, told The Sun, this kind of thing has gone on for ages because people don't like to see me do well. I've never handled the fame very well. I haven't worked this hard just for me to be slaughtered. Metro.co.uk contacted X Factor for comment.